Wow. Oh, I'm just exhausted. That was something. Good oh, ride, boys. Good ride. That. Oh man. That is gorgeous. It's beautiful. Well done. Let's get a picture oh, of the group. You know, that's yeah. a great idea. Um, Where do you want right to? Right here think... on the rock. Now oh, come over here. Come on, everybody. Come right, line it up. up. Get okay. tight. We'll get back on the road and ride okay. some more. All right, you ready? How's my hair? Great. Okay, one more. <laughs> Got it. That's one more vertical. Look. All right. Somebody get help! Who is this? Call 911! 911? Go, go, go. Okay, I got it! Go, I got go. it! Get him in the car! Okay. Relax. It's gonna be fine. You're gonna be okay. It's alright. Hang in there. Question. Theoretically, if you wanted to break into a maximum security prison, how would you do it? You mean to get past the razor wire perimeter fence, the roving patrols, closed circuit camera surveillance? Yes. Theoretically, I don't think you can break into a maximum security prison. Hmm. Hmm. I have plenty of other things I could be doing, Lisbon. I don't know why you brought me out here. It's good to get out in the sunshine and the fresh air. You've been holed up for weeks obsessing over Lorelei Martins. It's unhealthy. Lorelei Martins is the closest we've ever gotten there, right, John? It doesn't bother you that the FBI just took her away from us? Of course it bothers me, but there's nothing I can do about it. There's nothing you can do either. How long is this going to take? <sighs> it's a jurisdictional thing. It shouldn't take more than a couple hours. Jurisdictional? Vehicular fatality, we're in a state park. Park rangers aren't equipped to deal with this sort of thing. That's why we're here to do the paperwork. Excellent. Let's get on with it. Shall we? You guys must be CBI. It's about time. Sign here. Right. Just my luck. Damn it! What? Get your yellow tape out. It's a crime scene. Say what? It's a murder. Do whatever it is you do when it's a murder. Murder? What? No, it, it was an accident. Oh, really? Well, why weren't there any skid marks? Well, oh, but uh, damage to the guardrail in the case the car went straight through it at a high rate of speed. Which means the driver never engaged the brakes, never touched the steering wheel. So then it's a suicide. She was halfway through a cheeseburger. She just had her car cleaned. And, and where's her handbag? A woman like this would have a handbag, unless, of course, you have it. Do you have her handbag? No. Then it was stolen. Probably by the same person that pushed her off the road or tampered with the brakes. Wow. Yes, wow. My work is done here. Failed on their own. Definitely murder. Poor kid. What have we got so far? Uh, the victim was Cassie Flood, 26. She worked for Channel 7 doing human interest stories. I recognize her. Uh, she did that story about the baby tiger at the zoo, right? Probably. But the last story she did was on space travel for rich people. And ordinary people like me will be able to fly into space on this? Just walk up and buy a ticket? There are no ordinary people, Cassie. We're all of us extraordinary. 